Hello friends! Welcome back. I'm the organizer advisor Lisa Winfield and today we are going to be talking about enhancing our interaction with our dishwasher. Now this is such an invaluable tool in the kitchen especially if you cook a lot. So keeping it clean and well functioning is really important otherwise you just end up redoing or scraping dishes as they come out before you can put them up. Now my goal is to help you really enhance your experience in life and part of that is the interaction we have with all of the items that we surround ourselves every day, our tangible world. If we interact with something that makes us feel negative or lowers our vibration, it really makes us want to dread or we avoid using those items and then they can't really do anything to enhance our lives. We purchased everything we have to enhance our life and so keeping it clean, keeping it well functioning, keeping it high vibrational so that our interaction with it is on a higher frequency helps us to really enhance our daily living experience in our homes. So today we're going to talk about cleaning this wonderful tool that helps us facilitate um, cleaning up in the kitchen after we've cooked for our families or entertained. Now, there are two things that we're going to need to clean the inside of the dishwasher. We're going to need some distilled white vinegar and we're going to need some baking soda. So, but we'll also want a clean cloth and our Listerine spray to clean the outside. So let's get started. So the first thing that we want to do is we want to clean the outside. And we can do this using our Listerine spray and a soft cloth. Now this could be your flower sock towel or a paper towel. And what I like to do is just spray the Listerine spray. It's really good at removing kind of greasy dirt or fingerprints. So you want to make sure that you clean the outside, the sides, and the top. Now, I suggest not spraying directly on the appliance because then you spray the electronics and if uh, some of the spray gets in there it could short circuit your buttons. So I just spray the cloth and wipe everything down. Now next we're going to clean the inside. Okay so now we have the inside of the dishwasher and I like to take my Listerine spray and I like to wipe the seal all around to make sure there's no food gunk on there. Also the in, uh, around the seal of the door just so that the if there's any food particles stuck on there it doesn't uh, it doesn't break your seal. Also you may want to check your dish your little dish compartment where you put your dishwasher tab and your rinse compartment. So I just like to kind of wipe down the inside of the door just to make sure there's no residual food. Now we're going to clean the inside of the dishwasher and there are two steps. The first step is we're going to take one cup of distilled white vinegar and I put it into a spill proof container and I'm going to put that in the very top of my dishwasher and then I'm going to run it run it on a normal cycle and then I take it off heat dry I put it on high temperature and I wash all right now that that cycle is complete we're going to do we're going to do step two which is we're going to use about and I just wrinkle it in the bottom of the shirt. Just like Okay. Normal high heat. I take off heated at the end of this at this cycle sanitized and so everything will just feel wonderful okay so after and we the bottom just have a filter and 
and you want to make sure that there's no residual. You want to make sure there's no. Okay, so now that our dishwasher feels so much better, so the end of the items that we have to go through this process, beauty and also beautiful home and in your beautiful life.